Hello and welcome to my tutorial. This is going to be the first in my series for Camtasia Studios. Today I'm going to be going over a quick overview of Camtasia Studios and how to edit a video, add music and zoom stuff like that. So you want to start off by opening up Camtasia Studios or installing it from the TechSmith website which I'll provide a link for in the description. You should get something along the lines of this. That's either in the demo version or the full version. And uh, here you have like recent projects where all your any projects you've been working on recently are showed, obviously. And you get these options over here to record the screen, record voice narration, record PowerPoint, and import media. Just right, really want to start off by clicking close because that's really no good to you. And here is the basic overview of Camtasia Studios with nothing being entered. So you want to start, uh, so let's just start off. Or here you have the preview window where your video is shown. A uh, quick preview of it. Down here you have the timeline. This is where the audio and the video is shown on the timeline, so you can cut it and edit it and select parts. Over here you have the task list. This is stuff like import media and you produce your video and zooms and stuff. And here is the clip bin. This is where uh, any videos you have is put and audio and pictures and title clips, stuff like that. And uh, let's just start off then. I'll show you how to edit a quick video. I'm going to start off by going to import media. Navigate in to your video. And import that one. Then you want to right click that video in the clip clip bin, click add the timeline. And then you click uh, on the presets, click YouTube if you're uploading it to YouTube, whichever is best for you really. Um, yeah, so if you're using an iPhone or iPod or CD or whatever, select that. You can add custom and recording dimensions, which is what you use to record it. Just want to click YouTube eh, most of the time and click OK. <coughs> and here we can see is print of the timeline and in the preview window. And uh, so down here, this here is the video. You select it, clicking and dragging. Down here is the audio, and here is all the zooms and stuff like that that we've added, that I have added. So you can split up the so so yeah, yeah you can split up the audio from the video by clicking this line here, clicking yes, and now you can see we can move this around which we weren't, weren't able to do. If you want to delete that, just press delete on your keyboard with it selected. Then to replace it, click the import media music or whatever you got it, got your music too import the audio, right click that, add the track audio 1 or whichever one you want. And here we go, wait for it to load. It should work. Here we go. Now I'll say we want to cut this down to the size of our video. We just select the end of our video like that, drag it to the end of the music. Doesn't seem to be happening. Here we go. And just select cut. This little scissors tool here. There we go, let's get it down to length now. I say you want to add a new zoom in, so I want to zoom in on this over here. Just click zoom and pan uh, with the area selected like that. And just move this box around. Now I see one zoom in on the icon. Select it kinda like that. Unfortunately there's no way to get rid of the green bar which you'll see in a second. But you can make it zoom in faster and slower. Now if I just move that. See the green bar coming around it zooming in on the location. I don't think there's any way to remove that green bar. Which is a pity really. And now say you finished your video, uh, 
and you want to produce it. So by, to do that, you go produce video as, and you select the type, usually YouTube, go to next, and input the production name, click next again, and then you click finish, and then you should load and uh, produce your video, which should probably take about 10 minutes to do that, then you just upload it to YouTube or wherever you want to put it. Uh, so that's all for this tutorial. Next tutorial, I'll be showing you a bit more in depth in video editing. I'll show you how to use title clips and call outs and stuff like that. So, thank you for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe.